Microbicide is currently an experimental product. It's one that's not approved for market use by the FDA yet, so we're still doing all the research and trying to actually develop this thing we're going to call, or that we currently call, microbicide. And basically, it's hopefully going to be a product that women and men can use coincidentally, if you will, or at the same time point generally with sexual intercourse that will prevent the sexual transmission of HIV infection. Women are more and more kind of the face of the AIDS epidemic. So vaginal microbicides are really important because women don't have the same kinds of choices that men have around sexual intercourse other than abstinence and relying on or being able to negotiate condom use with their partner they have no way to protect themselves so providing a vaginal microbicide we hope will provide women with a way to take control of their own prevention and their own sexual health what I do in particular is try to understand what users experience when they use a certain product, so if they're using a gel, for instance, or versus a film that dissolves inside their body. And what do they actually experience when they use that product? And then they rate those experiences, and then I try to figure out, given those experiences, which would they actually choose to use? For me, the most important thing is that people keep getting infected. And it's a disease that is, on the one hand, very easily preventable in terms of people's behavior, um, but on the flip side is really hard to get people to do. Um, and so if we can come up with something that fits into people's lives, that allows them to have the same kind of sex life they always have, but also prevents a life-threatening infection, then that's the key.